Welcome back to Chimmy Joe Gaming. I'm Chimmy Joe, back with Portal 2, and we're going to meet GLaDOS. They should take us right to her. I can't believe I'm finally doing this. Woo! <laughs> I knew this would be fun. They told me it wasn't fun at all, so they said it's not fun at all. And I, I, I believed them. I thought I was a fool to myself. Ah, and I'm, I'm, lo I'm loving this way another time. Whoa, whoa. Sorry if you get motion sick. This place is I'll just stand forward. And we're only seeing the top layer. It goes down for miles. All sealed off years ago, of course. We should of be course. getting close. Oh, I can't wait to see the look on her face. No neurotoxin, no turrets. She'll never know what hit her. Uh, hold on, hold on, because I, I, mm, I might not have thought this next part would be. Ah! Well, uh, I'm, I'm going the wrong way. Get to her. I'll find you. Yeah, of course you will. All right, back to the showdown place of where GLaDOS was finally dead. Ooh, what's this? That's probably not a good place to go. Oh, it is, actually. GLaDOS emergency shutdown. Oh no! I truly didn't think you'd fall for that. <laughs> In fact, I devised a much more elaborate trap further ahead for when you got through this easy one. If I'd known you let yourself get captured this easily, I would have just dangled <laughs> a turkey leg on a rope from the ceiling. <laughs> well, I guess we were supposed to go that way. Up. Let's get to business. I hope you brought something stronger than a portal gun this time. Otherwise, I'm afraid you're about to become the immediate past president of the Being Alive Club. Uh-huh. <laughs> Seriously, uh -huh. though. Uh -huh. Goodbye. It's my big chance. This is trouble. <laughs> ah, not again. Here comes that. Lucky lady. Honestly. <laughs> you were busy back there. Well, I suppose we could just sit in this room and glare at each other until somebody drops dead. But I have a better idea. It's your old friend, Deadly Neurotoxin. If I were you, I'd take a deep breath and hold it. Hi, Wheatley. Hello. I hate you so much. Warning, Central Core is 80% corrupt. That's funny. I don't feel corrupt. In fact, I feel pretty good. Alternate core detected. Oh, that's me they're talking about! To initiate a core transfer, please deposit substitute core in receptacle. Core transfer? Oh, you are kidding me. <laughs> I've got an idea! Do what it says, plug me in! Do not plug that little idiot into my mainframe. No, you should <laughs> plug that little idiot into the mainframe. Don't you dare plug him in. Plug me in, plug me in! Don't do it. Don't listen to her, do it. Do I feel it. like she should have brought up a, uh, you know, a. Oh, we're so close! Plug an incinerator receptacle. Substitute core accepted. Substitute core. Are you ready to start the procedure? Yes! Corrupted core. Are you ready to start the procedure? No. Oh, yes, she is. No, 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 no. <laughs> stalemate detected. Transfer procedure cannot continue. Yes! Pull me out, pull Unless me a stalemate out, associate me is present to press the stalemate out, resolution me button. Pull me out, leave me in, leave me in, please don't press, don't press it! Don't do it. Yes, I, do I do have it. to. Not so fast. I have Think to. Think about this. You need to be a trained stalemate associate to press that button. You're unqualified. <laughs> hey, don't listen to her, alright? It is true that you don't have the qualifications, but you've got something far more important than a finger, alright, with which to press that button so that she won't get Impersonating a stalemate associate. I just added that to the list. It's a list I made of all the things you've done. Well, it's a list that I am making, because you're still doing things right now, even though I'm telling you to stop. <laughs> stop, by the way. Stop, by okay. the way. Uh, that's probably correct, but where it's incorrect is that while I've been stalling you, we just press the button. Use the moment of confusion I've just created to press the button. <laughs> 
Can, let me just, I don't know if I've ever taken the time to do this, but have I ever told you the qualities that I love most in you? In order, number one, <laughs> I, I love this game so much disputes. because uh, even if you so don't do anything, it will, you, it will just keep spewing things that are just funny. Like, there's a whole script they came up with just in case somebody just decided not to hit the button. Dispute resolution advisor in need of a button. <laughs> in need of a button. <laughs> Sorry to interject again, but if you do not push the button, the deadly neurotoxin emitters will come back online. I they won't come back online, I cut the things. Alright, let's press the button. Resolved. Here I go! Wait, what if this hurts? What if this really hurts? Oh, I didn't think of that. Oh, it will. Believe me, it will. Are you are you just saying that, or is it really going to hurt? You're just saying that, aren't you? You're just no, you're not. You're it is going to hurt, isn't it? <laughs> exactly. How painful are we talking? Ah! Stop me! No! Stop! No! 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 Oh, I feel I feel kind of bad. Right here, I am bloody massive, aren't I? Oh, right, yeah, the escape lift, I'll call it now. There we go, lift cool. Alright, cool, we're Look leaving. Look how small you are down there. I can barely see you. Let me tell you, I knew it was going to be cool to be in charge of everything. But, wow, this is cool. And check this out, I'm a bloody genius now. Estás usando este software de traducción de forma correcta. Por favor, consulte el manual. I don't even know what I just said, but I can find out. <laughs> oh, sorry, no, the lift. Yes, sorry, you forget. This body's amazing, seriously. I can't get over how small you are, but I'm huge. <laughs> Clearly, it's not the end, obviously. Uh, actually, why do we have to leave right now? Do you have any idea how good this is? I did this. Tiny little Wheatley. Did this. No, I did it. didn't do anything. She did all the work. Oh, really? That's what the two of you think, is it? Well, maybe it's time I did something then. What are you doing? No, no, no! And don't think I'm not onto you too, lady. You know what you are? Selfish. I've Selfish? I've done sacrifice to get us here. And what have you sacrificed? Nothing. Zero. All really? All done is boss me around. Well, now who's the boss? Who's the boss? How have I bossed you around? I haven't even talked. Ah! See that? That is a potato battery. It's a toy for children. And now she lives in it. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, uh, what? The engineers tried everything to make me behave. To slow me down. Months. They even attached an intelligence dampening sphere on me. It clung to my brain like a tumor, generating an endless stream of terrible ideas. No, not listening, not listening. It was your voice. No, you, no, you're lying, you're lying. <laughs> you're the tumor. You're not just a regular moron. You're you were designed to be a moron. <laughs> you're designed I to am be not a moron. A moron. Yes, okay. You Well, how about now? Now who's a moron? Could a moron punch you into this pit? Ah! Could yes. a moron do that? Yes. Uh oh. <laughs> there was a, a song that uh, somebody put out that was like a remix version of GLaDOS's voice just saying, I'm a potato. Hi. How are you holding up? I mean, I'm falling. Because I'm a potato. <laughs> because I'm a potato. Oh, good. My slow clap processor made it into this thing. So we have that. That's, that's nice. Since it doesn't look like we're going anywhere, well, we are going somewhere alarmingly fast, actually. But since we're not busy other than that, here's a couple of 
facts. He's not just a regular moron. He's the product of the greatest minds of a generation, working together with the express purpose of building the dumbest moron who ever lived. She and always falls over there. Of the entire facility. Good, that's still working. <laughs> I mean, probably not. Ow. Ow. <coughs> so, just like the first one, there is an underground section, if you haven't played this yet. And that's where we're going. And Wheatley did say that there are miles and miles of stuff underneath the Aperture Science tent testing facilities. The bird's pecking at the potato. No, GLaDOS, come back! Oh, we gotta go find GLaDOS. We have to save her now. Gotta go save the GLaDOS. up somewhere. Unless I just have to walk this way. Yeah, I just have to walk this way. <laughs> I keep thinking with portals, and sometimes I do not need portals. Condemned testing area. So obviously I need to use portal to get through here, but is there anywhere that I can hit with this? Um Okay, so there obviously should be. Oh, ladder doesn't work. Oh, there we go. Just gotta look around enough. Uh, down there. It's the entrance this way. Keep out. Danger. Keep out. Walking and we're walking. This game put in a lot like cooler like type puzzles um, than the other one. Uh, I really I really like all the goop, and we uh, we actually learn a lot about um, we learn a lot about uh, how the portal gun actually works. Very nifty. Okay, well. There we go, that's better. Button? Uh. Wait, what? How did that work? I actually have to walk around the whole thing. 
Okay. I think. Oh no, it's just three seconds. There we go. Imagine if that fell. That's heavy. Such a big door for such a tiny door. That's not electronic. Keep out. <coughs> well, I think that's where we're going to end it today. Uh, come back next time to find out what's behind this next door. Thank you for watching. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!